what's up guys? Welcome back once again. It is me, Mo. So happy to be here with you guys today. We are playing some more Balloons Heart Events battles. We're going to be playing with fans today. We're going to be playing on the all-water map. I'm going to roll Ninja, Sub, Buccaneer, and let's see what we can get as a bonus. Don't want an Engineer. Come on, I need something good. I, need, I don't want the Village. I need something good. None of that stuff's going to fit. Okay, we'll roll with the Boomerang Monkey. Let's see how we do against Mr. Spacely661. This should be fun. Hopefully he watches videos. I'm sure that he is because he's a friend on Game Center. So if he found my Game Center otherwise, that'd be really, really weird. But I'm excited for this. I hope that you guys are as well because we've never done like an all-water map. You know what I mean? So we're going to have a lot of subs. We're going to have a lot of Buccaneers. Hopefully we can go somewhat late game on this map with Mr. Spacely. So let's start off by getting our uh, sub as far in here as possible. And we're going to see what route he is going to go. Hopefully he's got a sub. What are you doing, buddy? Come on. There he goes. Building it a little bit late. We're going to go straight up to the airburst starts, as you guys know, and then we're going to start building Eco. Hopefully, Mr. Spacely knows that I like to wait until round four so you can have a good defense. It looks like he doesn't know, but that's okay um, because we're going to get it right there, and then now we can start sending it to him. I was playing with somebody else earlier, and they waited until, like, round five to start building Eco, uh, so I wasn't sending any because they weren't making enough money to build good defenses and then they just rushed me with all yellows like it was a full-on like rush like not trying to help me out not trying to go late game or whatever um so i unfriended that person um because you guys y'all know how i like to play y'all know what i'm trying to do in these videos you know that we like work together if i can tell that you can't defend i'm not gonna i'm not gonna send too much eco your way and if i ever play you guys and uh, it looks like I can't defend the eco. Go a little bit slow with it. It's okay to go slow with it. You don't have to rush it like hardcore initially. Um, you can give it a little bit of time and just know that you're working together for the same goal of going late game with the other person. So we're holding off okay right here. I might build one more sub right over here and give that one twin darts as well. Um, and you can see he's just he's just holding off. He's just grinding out that blue eco right now and i'll do the same thing now he's gonna switch over to greens i don't think he'll be able to defend greens honestly but he's just going straight for it i really hope that he upgrades something soon uh because he's gonna need it he's going to need an upgrade especially if i'm gonna be sending eco so um we're gonna start sending these greens as well there he goes building his other one um, so again guys if I am your friend on game center, we got to work together All right, just like I said like right here. I could save up until round 9 uh, Or 10 and just spam this guy with pinks and beat him because we're trying to work together uh, So that's just a big point because I was pretty frustrated because we played for like 20 minutes um, And then he went off and did that so it was a little bit frustrating because you know I was trying to play with a fan. I was trying to have a good time I was trying to let him be in a video and uh, he just did that so it was a little bit annoying we'll see what this guy does because yellows are kind of hard to defend initially um, so we're going to but we're gonna send some to him too because we got to make sure that he knows to spend money on defenses as well uh, we're holding it off okay because they aren't coming too quickly um, but let's go ahead and build a uh, what do you want to do let's build a ninja up towards the top and then get advanced intel on these guys as well. So we're going to put this ninja right in there. And let's grab advanced intel on uh, this guy right here. There we go. And now we're going to keep on sending ours as well. So we have a little bit more range than he does, which is good. He's holding off the yellows fine. Yeah, he's holding off the yellows fine. So we're not going to send... Uh-oh, one of them got through. Uh, oh, no, that was just lag. <laughs> oh, gosh, that was just lag, of course. Um, advanced intel right there and continue sending these we're not sending pinks yet i'm a little bit worried but it does look like he's just building right now um but if he sends too many pinks i don't think that i'll be able to defend it at this point so let's actually go ahead and build another sub let's get a reactor sub right in here i'm trying to get it perfect right right there and roll here advanced intel let's go ahead just throw this down to submerge and we're going to send a couple of pinks, not too many, just like that, one, two. And we're going to show him, like, hey, man, I'm not sending too many. Hopefully he catches the drift, Mr. Spacely. Uh, he had a positive KD. So, okay, yep, see, he did the same thing. So you send it in little bunches just to make sure that they can defend. 
it helps out and it just makes things a little bit more secure and you don't have to worry too much because we are working together like I was saying our goal here together is to go late game on a water map at least I hope that's what he wants to do because uh, it's gonna be epic um, so somebody was asking me earlier it was either in Twitter or comments like what rounds you want to have a certain number of eco by it's kind of uh, give or take especially depending on maps but if you can tell that your defense is doing good like it's easily holding off then build eco you know what I mean uh, we're gonna get our reactor sub right there that's gonna help us out a good bit and now we're gonna go back to sending greens because I don't want to rush him too much and I don't want to uh, overwhelm him but we still want to make some eco so by about round 20 I would like to be around a thousand eco if possible if not it's okay by round 24 if you can get there that's good um, so oh gosh well I didn't mean to send zebras my bad <laughs> what the heck did I send zebras oops he's probably like what the heck um, one little tip for you guys so the reactor sub I played with somebody earlier it was a fan and he didn't submerge the reactor sub. So guys, if you click on your towers, you'll see in the bottom left that they have abilities or they have targeting. You wanna make sure that you know what those targets are so that uh, the things that you're focusing on will, so that you can focus on what you wanna focus on. So like, if you feel like a whole bunch of Moabs are about to come out, you might wanna put some of them on strong, you know what I mean? Because that way they're gonna take out those Moabs and then they're gonna pop everything else underneath. Um, he sent a pink, so I'll go ahead and start sending pinks as well because the reactor sub can handle pinks for the most part. Uh, yeah, the reactor sub's doing perfectly fine with those. Uh, and thankfully, our uh, missile right there is taking out those leads as well. And we're holding off just fine here, around almost around 20. Let's try and get to about 900 eco or so. And then we are going to upgrade this ninja up here as well. Let's get a flash bomb ninja up here just to help out. Throw him on strong. Because I want him to, I want him to stun the strongest of of the balloons that come out. Um, so that's what I was talking about with targeting. You want to make sure that you know what you're targeting and what works best, uh, and on certain rounds what you want to do. So just keep in mind, try it out, try out different things, see what works. Sometimes strong works, sometimes strong doesn't work. So you got to be careful with that. We're about to get flash bomb right there. Boom! That's going to help us out a good bit. Uh, he's on strong, so he's holding up just fine. Uh, our man over here, Mr. Spacely's got a balloon chipper, so that's gonna be interesting because they're actually pretty good late game. They're actually really good late name, uh, late game. So we've got this rolling. I'm gonna get up to uh, it's round 21. Let's let's send Eco until round 22, as long as we're like holding off fine. So we're just gonna keep on sending Eco. He's holding off fine over there. All right, so here come a whole bunch of pinks coming through. Let's see if we can hold off. We're doing fine. We're holding off. We're holding off. Woo, they were getting a little bit scary there for me. So we're actually going to build um, a couple more uh, subs over here. Let's get airburst starts, boom, barbed darts, advanced intel. That's what I'm talking about. Okay, so we got uh, some ballistics coming through. Not some ballistics. Well, I didn't really need to boost that. I am going to get ballistic missile on this guy, put him on strong too, because they're going to pop those ceramics for us, which is going to help out a lot. So I didn't really need to boost there. But uh, also, if you're playing a friend, when they boost, send eco, because you know they can defend it. So that's just little things that you need to learn how to take advantage of as you're trying to go late game or as you're playing with friends and such. Um, so we're just going to continue building up here. Round 27, as you guys know, is the one round that we have to prepare for because that's when the first of the Moabs are going to be coming out. Um, he accidentally sent some reds. That's funny. So he's still sending pinks. I'm still sending pinks. It seems like he knows what he's doing. This should be uh, a good game as long as we don't get too greedy with the eco. We're at 1,300. I do want to build some Blue Jitsu Ninjas. So we're going to go ahead and build, start building some Bloon Jitsu Ninjas as well. So let's get a couple of Bloon Jitsu Ninjas up here. Let's throw, I'm going to start building off over here, even though I probably should have built closer in. That was kind of dumb. Uh, we got one of those guys down. I want to get up to 1,500. Uh, I want to get up to 1,500 so that we can build more subs for round uh, 27. We're almost there. We're holding off just fine. I'm not really too worried about anything. He's holding off fine too. There we go. Uh, let's actually sell this guy and build closer. So we're gonna put the first one right. Oh, come on. There we go Put the first balloon jitsu ninja right here. We'll get him in just a couple of seconds There we go right there ladies and gentlemen, and let's send a little bit more eco now We're gonna build a couple more balloon jitsu ninjas just to help out as uh, We are getting ready for round 27 So he's gonna boost there just to hold off. Does he have a balloon jitsu ninja yet? No, he doesn't he does have his balloon chipper which is dangerous guys Balloon chippers can be very, very dangerous because whenever you get regens coming out at like round 40, they just shoot them out and they just regen 
And then you just end up being in a lot of trouble. Oh, come on. Really? That sucks. All right, let's get this guy as close as we can to right here then. And we're gonna get, we're just going to build up Bloom Jitsu Ninjas until round 27. Uh, just to help hold off against all the Moabs that are coming out. And then we're going to start building up our eco again. You can see we're holding off really, really well. There's a whole bunch of regions on his side. They're popping out and going all over the place. Round 27 right here. Let's build up our first, uh, or not our first, our first, yeah, our first Bloom Jitsu Ninja on the right side of the map. He's sending more eco. Round 27 is almost here. And we are about to see a whole bunch of uh, Moab, or not a whole bunch, but we're going to start seeing Moabs come out. So now I'm going to send these off as he's defending against the Moabs. You can see that we're holding him off really well. I don't know why he decided to go with that balloon chipper. Uh, if I were him, I would have gone with the one that sucks up uh, or the 4-2 because that would have helped him out a lot better than that. So we're going to try and get it to 2,000 by about round 30, guys. And then by round 33, you want to be close to 3,000, honestly. Uh, just because you should have a good enough defense to hold off during those rounds. So he's doing perfectly fine right here. He's popping everything. I'm not worried. I don't think that I'm scaring him or anything like that. So we're fine with that. Let's keep on sending. Let's try and get up to 2,000 here. Uh, by the end of round 29, that would be perfect. I would love that very, very much so. And we're almost there. He's holding off. Okay, is he going to need a boost? No, he's fine. He's fine. And send a couple more. There we go. Boom. So let's start building a couple more uh, subs as well right over here. Here, come on, come on. There we go. One, two, one, two, three. Look at that. And then let's get, let's put our first buccaneer right over here, baby. And we are going to go all right on these guys so that they suck in the. Come on, I know that it fits there. There we go. We're gonna go all the way over here towards cannon ship, and then towards. I don't know what this one's called, but we'll see in just a couple seconds. Uh, monkey pirates. So we're gonna get that rolling, and we've got that. So now we're gonna start sending eco. Like I said, guys, we want to be at about round. We want to be at about 3,000 by round uh, 33 here. I probably should get a sabotage supply line, honestly, uh, just to help us out a little bit. Did we already get our pirate thing? We did. Am I going to need a boost here? Uh, I don't think I'm going to need a boost. Are we going to need to? No. Nice. We didn't need to boost. Sabotage supply line for us right there. He is boosted, so I'm going to send as much eco as I possibly can, like I was saying. You got to do that when you know that they're holding off well. Are we going to have to... Good lands. What the heck was going on right there? That was a little scary. Uh, let's get a Sabotage Supply Line Ninja right here and a uh, Flash Bomb, obviously, because it's building up towards it. And that's going to help us out a good bit. We'll throw this guy on strong as well. And let's get Sabotage Supply Line. Two of those are going to be great. They're going to help us out a good bit. He's holding off okay. Nice. So he went with the Buccaneer as well. Now let's continue getting our eco up. Round 33, like I was saying, this is where we're going to see our first of the BFBs. Um... And we've got two sabotage supply lines, so I'm not worried about it at all. We've also we've also got one monkey powered ability, which is gonna help us out. By the end of round 33, guys, I want to be at 3,000 eco, and I think that I should get there uh, because the beginning of round 33 is super easy. You can hold off the beginning of round 33 really, really easily, and then that's when you start seeing the Moab and the BFB towards the end of it. So you just gotta pay attention to that as you're playing. Learn the rounds that are slower at the beginning when you can send eco, and then you've made enough to build up stuff towards the end of it. Uh, so we might need to, there we go, sabotage the ply line right there. I'm going to go ahead and let these guys, let the Moabs get taken out, and then we're going to suck in one of those BFBs, get that thing to freak out of here, and let's build a couple more of, uh, of these Buccaneers over here because they are going to be key for us. One, two, look at this. We're going to go straight up to it again. Come on, buddy. Oh, gosh, is he going to need a boost? No, he used Sabotage. Nice. Good work. Sabotage supply line over here for us. And I think we're doing okay, guys. I'm, I'm enjoying this. We're, we're having fun. Let's get these guys rolling. Build up a whole bunch of these. Uh, of What the? I, I just drew a huge blank. We're going to build a whole bunch of these subs again. And we might build another. Let's build one more Sabotage supply line ninja right here. Straight up to it. That's what I'm talking about. Uh, and we're gonna spin a little bit of eco now that we have that sabotage supply line and we're able to hold off We're not at 3,000 yet. Like I said, I wanted to be there preferably around 33. So we're doing fine here and uh, This should be enough for us to build up a good bit round 40 as you guys know is the next round that we got to worry about So let's go ahead and build up more of our uh, Blue Jitsu Ninjas. So we're gonna get a whole bunch of Blue Jitsu Ninjas because we are going to need them very very badly at round 40 so we're going to start working towards that. Actually, you know what? It's not round 40 yet. What am I doing? You do need to prepare for it, but we're going to send eco until about round 37 uh, or 38. 
and then that's when we're going to start building up a whole bunch of Bloom Jitsu Ninjas, guys, because round 40 and 41, I would say, are the rounds that whenever I face people, they die the most. So you got to prepare for those rounds if you want to go late game. After that, it honestly gets easier. It gets way easier after round 41. You just got to be prepared for those rounds because they get crazy. Dude, use the Sabotage Supply Line. Oh, gosh. Use it. Use it. Or boost. Woo! That was close. That was close. I just got really worried. I'm going to hold off. I'm not going to send anything to him. Uh, so we'll keep on we'll keep on building up uh, subs over here. One, two. Oh, dang it. I got to sell it. And are we holding off that fine? Are we holding off? Yeah, we're holding off. All right, let's get this rolling. Let's go ahead and just use this ability over here and use this ability right there. Boom, that's what I'm talking about, baby. That's what I'm talking about, baby. I love these guys, man. They are freaking ridiculous. Let's build more of those. One, two, one, two, three, four. And we're just going to fill up seriously like this entire... Whoa, what? I can fit them like right in between. This is going to look crazy. One, two, one, two, three. Oh, hey, thank you, good sir, for letting me pull you in and getting you off of my waters. These are my waters. These waters don't have enough room for the both of us. Let's go all the way over again. We're going to get a whole bunch of these guys and just absolutely kill it. One, two, one, two, three, four. And we're seriously about to just fill up this whole side. One, two, one, two, three, four. Watch this. Get in here. Get the freak out of my waters. <laughs> these are my... If, all right, here's a good question, guys. If y'all are, are still watching, listen up. I need you to answer this, okay? If you could be a pirate... What would your name be? And if you're already a pirate, what's your name? <laughs> All right. I think Blackbeard is kind of a cool pirate name. Mine would... I, I don't know what mine would be. Mine would have something to do with, like, having a peg leg or something like that. I don't really know. I'm. Oh, shoot. We're almost around 40, and I was telling you guys that you got to be ready for it. You got to be ready for round 40. Oh, no. Is he ready over there? I don't know if he's ready. Does he... Uh, okay. He used Sabotage. We'll pop another Sabotage right there, even though they don't overlap. I don't think that we had one popped yet. Can I please get this Bloom Jitsu Ninja down? Thank you very much. That was freaking me out. And let's pull all these guys in. One, two, three. Get out of my waters, baby. Golly, those things are freaking killing it. Is he doing okay? Oh, no. Oh, no. Please hold off. Oh, my gosh. I'm really worried about him because he's got that freaking Bloom Chipper over there. And it's not going to be good for us. The Bloom Chipper might be the death of this coming round, guys. I am not looking forward to seeing what happens with this freaking balloon chipper. Look at it. All that stuff's flying by. We're going to use the sabotage right here. Let's go ahead and pull in these two BFBs. One, two, and three. And we are doing mighty, mighty fine. Nothing's distracting us over here. Keep on building up these balloon jitsu ninjas. That's what I'm talking about. Get these guys rolling. I'm still worried about him on his side. Come on, buddy. Boost or something. Hold off. Hold off, please. Pull in the BFBs. Pull in the BFBs. Pull them in. Yes, he's pulling them in. Nice. Oh, no. Boost. Boost. Please don't lose. No, please don't lose. Is it lag? Please tell me that's lag. All right, good. It's lag. Oh, my gosh. I was just so freaking worried. I was just so worried, guys. I did not want us to end on that. I did not want us to go down. Woo! There we go, baby. That's what I'm talking about. All right, so we're going to keep on building these guys. Look at this. I can fit so many in here. This is ridiculous. One, two, one, two, three, four. And where'd that other one go? Was it? There it is. One, two, one, two, three. Four. Get out of my waters, baby. Get out of my waters. And we're just going to let these guys roll around for a little bit and send up some eco. And we're just going to let these guys keep popping. Let's take out that one and take out that other BFP. You know, let's just take out the, uh, you know, let's just take out the other one. <laughs> oh, those abilities are so freaking sick. Those abilities are so sick. Can we, let's see if there's any, get up, 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 up. Where was that? Right here. All right. I did not think that that was going to be there, but okay. Um, let's get a couple more subs rolling as well just for that little uh, little bit of background damage sabotage supply line right there let's just go ahead and boost it i don't know if he has a boost available so i'm, I'm gonna stop sending i don't want to send eco and freak him out or anything uh so let's get these guys rolling oh no please uh, i think that it's gonna be lag again on his side i really really hope that it's lag and that he actually isn't going down here that was freaking close he got a first strike ability over there which just did work oh whoa what oh my gosh <laughs> i tried to drag a tower and it didn't drag so i thought that he had lost that happens all the time to me, and I'm like, what the heck is going on? All right, so he used his ability. Come on, buddy. Hold off. Oh, my gosh. Hold off. Here comes the first ZOMG. Can we? Oh, we can't suck that in. So we're going to use Sabotage Supply Line. I'm going to build a couple more subs right in here. One, two, one, two, three. And can I build one more in there or no? All right, no. So we can't fit any more subs in there. I think we can fit one right here. We can. One, two, one, two, three. 
And you know what, let's just go ahead and get this first strike ability. Sabotage once again. Boom, let's pop that in. One, two, three, and we'll just let that last one pop on its own. And let's go ahead and start sending a little bit more eco. I'm gonna build a, another Sabotage Apply Line Ninja right down here. Get that guy rolling. Let's get some more Bloon Jitsus up here just to help out because you guys know that we need that extra damage on the Moabs and everything. So we're gonna get those rolling. And let's keep on building up our ego, guys. Round 43, this is freaking awesome. Uh, I'm gonna try and get to about 4,500. And then we're gonna build a whole bunch more ships over on the other side of it. Come on, buddy, hold it off, hold it off, hold it off. Use that first strike if you have to. Uh, let's go ahead and, yeah, so he pulled that guy in, dope. Let's upgrade these, one, two, one, two, three, four. I don't know if I'm gonna do any of the other ships because I think these are gonna be the key thing for us in defending right now. One, two, three, four. Look at that. All right, let's put up Eco because all that he's got is that ZOMG and uh, he can pop it with his first strike ability fairly easily. So we're gonna use our first strike ability as well right there and we're just gonna let these guys pop. We're gonna let them do their own thing, sabotage the ply line and we should be able to hold off really easily right now uh, at this point. Oh gosh, oh gosh, oh God. Yeah, we're doing fine. All right, so they're holding off just fine. We're gonna get up to 5,000 eco in just a couple of seconds. Nice, he just did a good amount of work. We're gonna get that 5,000 and we are just going to crush building these things and uh, just absolutely killing it. Sabotage the ply line, slow all those guys down and get that 5,000, boom. Another first strike ability and, or capability, I guess is what it is, but it, oh no, what? Oh gosh, I better plug this in, woo! That was close, that was freaking close. Let's upgrade this guy. One, two, three, four, and one, two. There we go. We're just gonna fill this whole side up with the boats. Uh, the boats, the mighty pirate ships of Balloons Tower Defense Battle, Sabotage Supply Line. And you know, let's just go ahead and pull in some of these BFBs. Get off of my map, boy. One, two. What? Guys, they freaking did it again, man. The first strike abilities are broken. It just went after his eco. Are you kidding me? The first strike ability just went after his eco. That is a joke. That is a massive freaking joke that that just happened. Goodness. Sell this, get first strike, and sell this, get first strike, and get first strike again. And let's pop one, one, two, three, four, and one, two, three, Four, one, and one, two, three, and four. Look at that, baby. That is what I'm talking about. Let's get it rolling. One, two, one, two, three, four. Come on. Oh, no. Okay, so we can't go four yet on that one. Uh, we are just going to continue building this up. Sabotage the ply line right there. One, two, one, two, three, and four. Shoot, there we go. Let's pop one and two and use one of those abilities. We'll go ahead and just boost here just to be safe and continue building these guys. This is a pretty epic game. I'm actually having a lot of fun uh, playing on this map. Sabotage the ply line right there. I'm gonna build up some eco while he's doing his own thing over there. We are going to run into some serious trouble shortly with these ZOMGs if we don't get our abilities back up on all of these pirate ships. Uh, so I'm actually gonna build some more, right? Come on, one, two, one, two, three, four. There we go, and one, two. Use that first strike ability. Sabotage the ply line, first strike, there we go. Bring one of these in. I'm gonna need to build some more. Oh no, oh no! He went down, Mr. Spacely went down. Guys, that was epic, I hope you enjoyed. If you did, make sure you leave a like on the video. Playing on practically an all water map. It's like 80% water, absolutely ridiculous. Um, again, let me know, what would your pirate name be, all right? Comment down below what your pirate name would be. Also, hashtag late game, hashtag late viewer. I love you guys so much. As always, make sure you keep calling me your pop on. I'll see you on the next episode, all right? Peace.